Okay, folks, here we go. Today we're going to try to uh, do what I was trying to do last night. Take this gator and sprayer and actually spray some fertilizer on my hay field. Uh, yesterday, as many of you know, trying to get these tanks cleaned out, no matter what the size, no matter if they're the little bitty small ones like this or the great big uh, farm supply ones that are used or on the farm, whatever, the great big ones, getting them all cleaned out. That can be a real pain in the butt sometimes. Um, but fortunately on this one here, right here at this fitting here, and on, now on this particular setup, I've got three nozzles. I got one over here on the boom here, one in the middle, and then one on the other end of the boom. Right there. All right. So I've, in all four of those spots is a mesh filter that, I'll do it this way, looks like that. Matter of fact, here's a brand new packet of my bought. I think I bought these actually last year. Sorry about that camera angle. But they are a 50 mesh spray strainer, four pack. And that's what I've got in there. Um, but anyway, the thing is, you know, you try to get these tanks cleaned out, they wind up with sludge in them, whatever. And kind of a hard to avoid thing, but I can't remember, it sucks. But anyway. That was yesterday's issue. I kept having the, that uh, screen sp strainer kept plugging up on me, so uh, trying to get that crap sludge out of the bottom of the dang tank. And so to, I think I finally got that cleaned out. So today I'm going to show you the thing going across the little hay field. Well, you're going to go for a ride along what you're going to do. But anyway, I'm going to stop here. I just I'll let you know kind of what the issue was, why I couldn't spray last night. And we'll go on from there. So uh, we'll go from there. Thank you. And for those of you that are curious, what is he putting on that field for fertilizer? Liquid in this case. This is what I'm using. I'm going to use this Gordon's Lawn and Pasture Fertilizer 2000. Uh, two and a half gallon jug will treat up to, cover up to 15,000 square feet. And so that is, uh, that's a 15 gallon mix. Uh, it's 12.5 gallon of water and 2.5 of the, um, of this here makes up 15 gallon. I'm mixing up 30 gallon at a time. So I'm putting two of these in with 30 and get a total 30 gallon of water. So if you're curious, that's what I'm spreading on there, spraying on there. Um, just got it at the local, or in my case, local Rural King uh, Farm Supply. Uh, about 22 bucks a jug there. Um, but things you do for a hobby. Uh, hang on, we'll do some, go for a ride along here in a second. Okay, folks, we're going to try the ride along thing here. Let me just hit the switch. Get that sprayer going. Just a little rough with this dang thing, but and I know a custom applicator could be in here and take him longer to get here, it would be to do the field. 
looks like those 90 foot booms they could be done in about five minutes it's going to take me most of the afternoon with this so i'm just covering about eight foot at a time if that but uh but yeah that's what we're doing we're uh spraying some fertilizer on here we'll see if we can't uh, uh make it grow or burn it now you can put down too much fertilizer at one time and you can burn them pretty good but uh like i always say it's just a hobby so of course hate to lose money on a hobby sometimes but it it happens um, just try and get this little field hay field to do something pretty good in the end. But, uh, but anyway, I'm gonna stop you here. You pretty much got the gist of what I'm doing. Spraying fertilizer on a little bitty two acre hay field. And uh, hopefully, I can get back with you sometime later soon. Get the old 806 out. And let you uh, go for a ride along on it doing the mowing of this and raking or tetting, whichever all I got to do to it. But, uh, ready to cut out here uh, anyway thanks for watching please comment rate and subscribe and I will uh, catch you on the next one stay safe bye